Hello, I'm Kim Young Du, a thoracic surgeon at Catholic University Puchon St. Mary. There are three main treatments for lung cancer surgery, chemotherapy, and radiation. Among these, the most effective treatment that can be expected to be cured is surgery. But there are more patients who can't operate at the time of diagnosis, then they get chemotherapy or radiation therapy. Some patients are able to undergo surgery during treatment. Surgery for lung cancer involves resecting the lungs and removing the lymph nodes around them. So, the most effective surgical treatment right now is video-assisted thoracoscopic surgery which uses a robot to perform a lobectomy and cleaning the mediastinal lymph nodes next to it. Lungs are divided into three lobes on the right and two lobes on the left. The lobe is the basic unit that divides the lung. If you remove one of the lobes, the rest of the lobe expands. The thoracic cavity narrows and eventually fills in all the empty spaces. Depending on the patient's condition, it usually takes two to three hours. You have to quit smoking at least two weeks before the surgery. From the day before surgery, you need to practice breathing deeply and coughing to spit out any phlegm to recover quickly after the surgery. Lung cancer is a terrible disease that can threaten our lives, but after a successful surgery and recovering well from it, you can live a healthy life. I recommend that you prepare for your health in advance by finding a good hospital that will detect your cancer early and perform the surgery as soon as possible. Today, we talked about lung cancer surgery and post-operative care. To treat lung cancer, even if you don't have symptoms, it is important to detect and operate quickly through active examination. Our Puchon St. Mary's Hospital has a specialized cooperative system for lung cancer, so we can solve all of that. Thank you.